All right, white America, it is time to look up as Jim Crow is speaking. Now, y'all might not know me very well, but don't let that be a circumstance, as I promise you, your ancestors did. Since it's 2016 and election time, I'll make it short. We have seen too much happen in recent times. First, Barack Obama, the president, is a black man. They put a black man in the White House? Our house? Come on now, that ain't fair. Harriet Tubman done beheaded the slave master Andrew Jackson and replaced it with her own. And worst of all, there are more black kids in colleges than there are in prisons. Now, we can't have that, can we? No. We gotta act quickly. We done tried inducing torment and fear, but that form of oppression seemed not to burn their spirits as dark as they skin. No, we need a more direct approach. I say what we do is reimport Jim Crow laws. Any Negro caught south of the Mason-Dixon line will have to abide to the following, which includes, but not limited to one, segregation between whites and blacks within any public setting shall be allowed. So that means all you mulatta zebras and designer pandas are not the future of America. I am. We, the white people, have to make America great again. I will not stand back and let these black people take it from us. Two, whites should not serve black people. Patience. Why? Because it is necessary that they all die out as a race. Three, <laughs> marriage should only be shared between a man and a woman of that race and gender. So that means for you gays too, <laughs> do not let them confuse you as they are confused themselves. Four, no landowner should be able to rent out a room to a black Negro. Why? Because just cause evictions are just in my eyes. Five, you should not be able to serve all white patrons unless you are an immigrant, of course. Then you could be a butler or maid in one of our fine hotel establishments, houses, and or restaurants. Six, I don't care if any Negro in America over 25 holds a high school diploma. The statistics say that's 84%. Well, it do not matter to me. You wanna know why? Because these Negroes here, it does not matter. They cannot vote in America, the white America, unless it comes time for them to do so, which will be never, all right? White America, wake up. I am your Messiah, and this is a warning. They are educated, they think their lives matter, and they are going to start to realize their history as kings and queens instead of slaves and sharecroppers. I am telling you now this warning is necessary, because if not, then they'll bring this industry down. But we refuse to let that happen. Why? Because at this very moment, we'll find one and one way only. These laws trump right over them. Thank you. I am Jim Crow, and this is White America. Hallelujah.